months to stay, so mm -hmm. he didn't need to come talk to me. I don't know about that. That's basically what he said. I'm unimportant. Wow, doesn't, that's ballsy. Yeah. So I have the boats. It doesn't matter what I say to you. I. It doesn't matter what you do. I'm staying. Has he... So, when, did he, when did he say that to you? Huh? Huh? When did he say that to you? Yesterday. Wow. But I did talk to him about the Danielle thing, and he will honor his word. He said, do you trust them? He said his word's good. Yeah. Oh, you, you brought up... You oh, brought, yeah. That a girl. Yeah. That's so remember smart. I talked to you. Mm -hmm. And I was like, and I was like, just, just be, just be flat out with him. Yep. Just straight up and just say, yeah. You know, remember that we talked. So, yes, I feel good about it because he would honor that he said. Mm -hmm. But yet, he didn't come to me to make a deal because he doesn't need to. I think that. So he's pretty confident he's staying. Mm -hmm. Did Joe come and talk to you? And then Joe came and talked to me. But he didn't ask for a deal or anything. He just asked from He the... just was like, you know, house thing, you know. Mm -hmm. He didn't come right out and ask for any bargain or anything. But he knows, like, he, he said for sure you're not voting for him to stay in Amber. I, we, had a, we had a moment last night on the hammock, and and I said, you know, I go, it's nothing personal, Joe. I go, but you will try and make this personal, but the way that you've played this game in this house and the way that you've treated me and other individuals is untrustworthy. I said, and, you know, I can't see that working to my advantage at all later on in this game or in this house or ever. You know, just, just the way that you have manipulated me and lied to me and the way that you've treated me and the way that you have... You know, the way that you lied to Carol the first week and you told Carol that you would have her boat. I go, right off the bat, I go, you're just setting yourself up. And I just don't see that working to my advantage or to your advantage later. Mm -hmm. And he was, of course, very upset with me and, you know, had very harsh words to say and, you know, took it to a very dark place, a personal level. And I said, it's not personal, it's strategy. And, you know, when I walked down those stairs. But you know him better than any anybody. In, in general, his character, what's mm -hmm. his character like? Is he, will he lie or was that just a slip up and a mistake the first week overzealous? Or is that his character to not believe him? From, from my experience in this house, I mean, from my experience with him, when I first met him in, in June 2005, he was a different person than he is now. He was honest, and he was loving, and he was caring, and that was the person that I that I truly I truly love that person, mm -hmm. and I, I I don't see that person in him anymore. You know, I didn't see that person in him a year ago when I left him last summer. He's changed. He's become paranoid and insecure, and you know, over overcompensating for that by lying and making false promises and. You know, and, and behaving exactly how he's behaved in this house. 